the stories you would hear, how did that how did that affect you? Like you would hear like, man, your dad is reason blah blah blah, you know, because he's the yeah. founder of you know that 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 whole blood movement when you when it come down to East Dallas and yeah. all that happened. Like, how, what how did it affect you hearing them stories? It really didn't affect me. Like, I just you know. I just like it is what it is, you know. I, yeah. It didn't really just affect me, like. But as a kid, like young, it was a lot of people coming up, like, you know, your dad do this, do that. So you know, but it really, I just really never really just thought about it, you know. Yeah. Yeah, yeah we on boss talk one on one. Yeah, we gonna talk. Hey man, we're in here today, man. We got a very very special guest, man. This brother right here been working, man. I started researching him and found out it's a jewel in the city, man. Head hunch or mirrors in the building. What's going on, man? What's going What's on? What's going on, man? How y'all doing? How y'all man, doing? we hanging in there, man. I just uh, like I said, I crept up on your music, man, cause of somebody you know, you know who, you know, he put it in my <laughs> ear, and uh, next thing you know, I'm like, oh man, this thing got a body of work. Ain't no limit to this shit. I feel like Master P jumped inside the game to feed my family. Can't do shit for free Man so let's get to it The way but you do I wanna it. know Why they call you head honcho Let me start head off like that honcho. Where you get the name You know when you think about Head mm. honcho I'm thinking about Somebody in charge I don't show my face Bro surge But it came from me I'm the one head Pete block jumpers Yeah What's up I had got head honcho from It was a guy like Real close to the family Really like an uncle He had died like 2018 mm. And he, he had the honcho clothing Like he was pushing His own brand Okay So then that's when I was like, you know, head honcho. Like, head honcho. I'm going to run with it, head honcho a mirror. So that's what we're doing. I like it, though. I really do. So you were born and raised in Dallas, Texas. Yes. What part? East Dallas. East Dallas. Yeah. Okay. Um, siblings? Oh, no, you have a sister, right? Yeah. Do you I have any brothers? No, nah, I'm, I'm, I'm the youngest. I'm the only boy. You're the youngest. Yeah. So how many girls? I got Talia, DeAndra, Regina, and I got Chana. How does it feel like growing up being the only boy and the baby boy that too? Spoil. Nah, it's just, you know. Yeah. <laughs> I love my sister though. But it was boring though, only boy. Like on my granny side, I was the only boy grandchild for the mm-hmm. longest. So, yeah. And I bet you they don't look at you as no little brother because you tall and you big. Like, they, shoot. They still do. They, be, they, they look at you like yeah. little brother. Yeah, they look at me, yeah. They used to beat you up? No, no, they didn't do that. They didn't do that. that. Okay, because I always heard that when a guy raised with all these Uh girls, they're like, they know how to get the girls because of that. It's like you have an insider trick. Was it like that for you growing up? For sure. For sure. Raised around women, like, yo. Tell me something you learned raised around women that helped you in your relationships. I ain't gonna lie. I learned that like, shoot, when they mad, they just mad. Like, just and you can't go back and forth with them. Like, just go on, you gonna leave or just you know just let them say what they gonna say. I agree with you hundred percent, young man. <laughs> nah, for sure. You hit that real real tough on the knob. Don't even don't even worry about it. Can you see that with your sisters? It. Yeah, I seen that with my sisters for sure. Sisters, oh, okay. My mama. Yeah. Uh-huh. So were you raised with your mom and dad in the same household? Nah, no. No? Not in the same household. In the beginning it was, right? I mean, I was so young, I don't really remember. You don't remember? How old were you when? I think they was, yeah, at the point, yeah. yeah. How old, do you know how old were you when he left? Or they broke separate? I don't know. You you were that young. I was young, I don't remember. Okay, did it affect you though? Growing up not having your dad in the household compared to, because he was still a part of your life? Yeah, he was still a part of my life. He didn't really just, affect me that much because I still was seeing them the mm-hmm. same as if we was in the same household so okay. it didn't really affect me that much because I hear men now um, grown would say you know there is a difference there is a difference when a child wakes up and know that there's a mom and dad there in the same household you're yeah. able to implement certain rules right then and there when certain things happen and stuff like that rather than being yeah. somewhere else and she have to call come get your son da 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 you know yeah. what I mean yeah I, I get what you're saying yeah, cause you have kids now no I don't have no kids no kids no kids okay yeah no kids. yeah yeah he, he chilling he ain't trying to get yeah, no I'm kids chilling right now he ain't trying <laughs> yeah. to get no kids right now the one thing I can can say is uh, the music definitely is a place where you feel comfortable because 
yeah. talking to you here versus listening to you on the music. You don't never stop rapping here. I can't hardly get a word out of you. What's going mm -hmm. on? That nah. that same <laughs> energy is not the same, boy. You nah. when you hear that music. He ain't playing no games. He get in the zone, man. Doctor he Heckle and Mr. Yeah, Jack, Mr. Yeah, Hyde. Yeah, yeah, Two man. different personalities. Nah, you know I just be chilling. Like I'm just laid back. I be chilling. So yeah, but I got a question. Go so because um, I know that your dad had went away for a while, um, but growing up while he was gone, um, did you see that absence? Did you feel no, that absence? See, when my dad went to jail, he did. He went to jail when my sister was born. Okay. I was born. I I was born once he got out of jail. Oh, so okay. So you did I not experience, experience that. Yeah. that at all. He was in jail when my sister. Okay. Was got it. Wow. I wasn't born yet. Yeah. He had me once he got out of jail. Okay. Got it. That's hard too. That's kind of like me. Mm -hmm. Having uh, my our two kids, mm -hmm. but the ones before they know, but yeah. the younger ones same don't. thing. You yeah. know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, you know. Um, you just basically, hey man, you got the you got the better better half. To yeah. be honest with you, because when a person is is going through and get you know pretty much change up their whole strategy, you get you know the new improved. You know what I'm saying? But the old is needed. You know what I'm saying? You need yeah. both of it to make one. You know what I'm saying? Nah, for sure. So that's the real deal. Like, what are some things that when you think about uh, just family and you you know you being a brother that's now for the good? You in them streets now, man. You know what I'm saying? You basically, you outside. How old was you when you really first started really just getting out into the community? You had, you from East Dallas. Yeah. So how how old was you when you really just just started getting out there seeing what, what them streets do? I'd say like, probably like 15, 16. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I already, already seen what was going on because like our street, like, you know what I'm saying? I seen my uncles down, you know, we always have a, events and block parties so as I'm walking around to the walking to the store or whatever I'm seeing what's going on in the streets you know what I'm saying but as far as me like actually getting out there on my own probably like 15 16 the stories you heard about your dad into lucky right the, yeah. the stories you would hear how did that how did that affect you like you would hear like man your dad is reason blah 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 you know because he's the yeah. founder of you know that 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 whole blood movement when you when it come down to East Dallas and yeah. all that happened like how, what how did it affect you hearing them stories it really didn't affect me like I just you know I just like it is what it is, you know. I, yeah. It didn't really just affect me, like. But as a kid, like young, it was a lot of people coming up, like, you know, your daddy will do this, do that. So you know, but it really, I just really never really just thought about it, you know. It, yeah. it didn't just, make you walk out there with your chest, you know, nah, stuck out like, like yeah, I ain't, I'm. I ain't get cocky or nothing. Like it just, you know, that was what it was. That what pops had going on, you know. So you know, it was what it, it is. What it is. Did he ever talk to you about it? Uh, about yeah. the what? Because he got books out now. For, yeah, for sure, I got his stuff. book at the house. He signed it for to, me. Yeah, I used to read the little newspaper stuff. He had his office stuff. I used to, you know what I'm saying? I Google and look it up myself, you know. But you know, it is what it is. Like, yeah, it didn't really just make me be like, oh, my dad, it is. I can, you know what I'm saying? I feel like I'm better than somebody, or I'm tough, Utu. Nah, be me, you know what I'm saying? What Pops did, that's what he did, you know? Yeah, but some of the things that that he represented, it it didn't ever fester back up or affect you in any kind of way. Nah. Which is a good thing. Nah. Because it, it, it don't always have to go that way, you yeah. know what I'm saying? It could have been some things that was lingering, because I know them streets is different, and niggas is, you know, different people feel different ways about different things that happen in the streets. Yeah. So you have to walk outside and face the mad, oh, the madness because of what had happened in some situations. Thank yeah. God yours wasn't that way. Yeah. yeah. You know what I'm yeah, saying? I feel where you come from. Yeah, because it could have been it like It could have been different. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we going to talk.